Good morning, children. The distributed online class for 15 students. First, we will learn their articles. We start the class with open and now take the preparation first. Join your hands and close your eyes. You will also put a practice there. Okay. Oh, Guru Brahma, Guru Vishnu, Guru Devo, Maheshwara, Guru Saksha, Palat Brahma, Tasma Ishri, Guru Ve, Namaha. Oh, Shanti, Shanti, Shanti. Now slowly open the eyes. Mahatma 
objects are so in previous to be careful listen children so we have a singular object means we use that this and so that uh, this object means near first means we use that this so so in the singular object we have a far from us means we use that that too. okay so today we learn these and those so more than one objects or persons animals places so we have a more than one persons means we use these are so these persons are near to us so means more than we have a one objects means we have we use that these are so these objects are near to us means we use these and this when the when we have a more than objects for far from us means we use that those okay so now open your textbook children you see that from page number Fourteen. Yes, see, children. Usage of these and those. Okay. So yes, see, we have it here three auto rickshaws, and then we have it three cars. Okay. So these are rickshaws. So because these auto rickshaws are near to us. Okay. So here we have it more than one object. Is yes, no one. And here those are cars. Here also we have three cars because those cars are far from us. Okay, so these are auto rickshaws are near to us, and those cars are far from us. So that's why these for auto rickshaws, and that's why we use those for cars. Okay, and next these are tomatoes. So here we have more than one tomatoes. So those are these tomatoes are near to us. Okay, and we are having carrots. So those are carrots. Why we use those? Because those carrots are far from us. So these. Why we use these tomatoes? Because these tomatoes are near to us, so that's why we use these. And why we use those for carrots? Means those carrots are far from us, so these are tomatoes and those are carrots. And next, these are carrots. Why we use these are carrots? Because these carrots are near to us, so that's why we use these are carrots. And next, those are pigeons. Why we use those? Because of Those pigeons are far from us. Okay, so these parrots are near to us. You see the distance in between those and these children. So here small arm up for these and long arm up for those. So you now try to understand children. These are parrots means so these parrots are near to us. So when we use those, means those are pigeons means so those pigeons are far from us. Okay, and next. These are fishes. So you have seen the distance in between these and those. So these fishes are near to us. So that's why we use these are fishes. More than one object means we use these are. So these objects are near to us means we use these. So more than one object we are having far from us means we use that those. Okay. So those are dolphins. These fishes are near to us. Those dolphins are far from us. So that's why we use this for near the objects and we use those for far from us the objects. Okay, we have more than one objects means we use the these and those. So when the object is near to us means we use these or when the objects are far from us means we use the those. We have a singular object in near means we use this concept. We have a more singular object in far from us means we use that that concept. Okay, this and that. So there is difference in between this and that, that and these and those. Yes, see children, listen carefully. When we have a singular object means so that object is near to us means we use that this. So when the object singular object means that is far from us means we use that that concept. Okay, and here we have more than one objects or persons, animals, places or things. Yes, no. So that's why. So when the objects are near to us means We use that these, and when the objects are far from us, we use that those. Understood? You yes, see difference in between these and those. They give us show the animal also. So difference in between these and those. Okay, well, so in this you know, once again I explain. These are rickshaws, and those are cars. Because these rickshaws are near to us, and those are cars are far from us. So that's why we use those. And yes, these are tomatoes. Those are carrots. So these tomatoes are near to us. Those carrots are carrots are far from us. And yes, these are parrots and those are pigeons. You 
see the error mark distance between what they show that distance of these and those. So because these, this is they give a small error mark for the these concept means these means where we use these. So when the objects are near to us means we use these. These are parrots and those are pigeons. So those pigeons are far from us. So that's why we use their those. And next these are fishes. Why we use these are fishes because these fishes are near to us. Those dolphins are far from us. So that's why we use these. Those these for the near object. Those for the far from us objects. Understand? So now let us write children. So open your now English class book. We write write down children. These and those. These and those. We must have read this heading children. So that heading of computer app of come to next page. So the next slide right there. T H E S E. These. You put double inverted comma for these word. Is used. So this is definition for the these and those children. So you also write down used when the objects are near to us. Near to us. This is used when the objects, not only object, objects means more than one. Objects are near to us, so we use these. And next, write the definition for the those. So you put. Double inverted comma for those four children. Those is used when the objects are when the objects objects are far from us. Far from us. Yes, see children. This is used when the objects. So here. Be careful, understand? Object means singular. Objects means plural. More than one. We have more than one means we use that, that. These are near to us means we use these. When the objects are near to us means we use the, these. And when the objects is far from us means we use those. Understand? Okay. I hope you all are understand. So next, write down question answers for these concepts. These are those. Write down first one. Write the heading. Answer the following. Answer the following questions. First one. What are these? What are these? So write small armor because so these objects are near to us. So you draw the picture of balloons. So you draw two balloons. So write down my question. What are these? So what is the picture of the given here? What is this? Balloons. Yes, no. So now you will make sentence and write children. So how to write? First you write this word. These. T H E E S E. These. Why we use these? Because these objects are near to us. So you have. We have to see the arrow mark distance. Okay. So these are right next A R E R. What is the spelling of balloons? B A L L O O N S. Balloons. Okay, Chuna. What are these? These are balloons. So why we use these? Because these balloons are near to us. So that's why we use. These are okay. And next, what are those? What are those? T H O S E. Those. Put question mark to draw the line and mark. Now you understand, children. So they give a line and mark means you understand that. So those objects are far from us. So we having short and mark means so you just understand. So these are near to us. These objects are near to us. So now let us see what are those. Why we use those here? Because those objects are far from us. You see the distance in between arrow and this is uh, near to objects. This is far from the objects. Okay. So what are those? So now we will make sentence and write. How to write make sentence? First you write. 
write this word those right next new one finger space after right are those are what children eggs what are those what they given in the pictures eggs those are eggs e g g egg and add s because we are having more than one eggs no so you write the plural word eggs egg is a singular word x is a plural word what are those those are eggs understand and next let's come to third word leave one line children after right next third word what are these each one more question answers finish up your leave one line after right the next one so now you draw the small i have at least short i have not this ways of so you understand that so these are we not to us so you draw the picture of trees you know what are these trees okay so now you we'll make sentence and write first you write these t h e s e these right next a r e r why we use r because more than one objects we have in this we use r so we have one is is this is like that okay we have more than one is r we use r so these are trees what is the spelling of trees t r e e yes trees because why we use this These trees are near to us. You see the aromatic. Okay, so they give it here. Short aromatic means you have to keep in your mind. So these are why we use these means. So you see the aromatic because these uh, objects are near to us. You understand? Right. Next fourth one. What are those? What are those? Draw the line around her because you understand now. So these objects are far from her. Now understand? So now what are these children? What are those? Those are jugs. So why we use those? Because those objects are far from her. You see the animals difference in between. So long I am not giving you will know. So you understand like that. So that make that given make that you have to write those because those objects are far from her. So now we'll make sentence and write first with those T H O S E those right next to A R E R. What are those? What are given in pictures? Jugs. What is the spelling of jug? J U G jug and R S. So because we have one jug, means we write jug singular word. We have more than one two means, so we write the jugs plural word. Okay. And right next one fifth one. What are These what are these? Put question mark and short. Draw the short arrow mark. Now you understand. So now these objects are near to us. They give a small arrow mark means. So you just understand that channel. So these objects are near to us. Okay. So now we use these. So now we we'll make sentence and write T H E S E these. After the one finger space E R E R. Right next, what are those? What are these in the pictures? Balls. These are balls. What is the spelling of ball? B A L L. Ball. You write S. Means ball is a singular word. We have one ball. Means you write ball only. We have more than two balls. Means we use their balls. Plural word. Balls. Ball. Ball is a singular word. Balls is plural word. So these are balls. What are these? You know, these are balls. Why we use these here? Because these balls are near to us. Okay. And right next sixth one. What are those? What are those? Those means you understand, you know. And you see the animal also. Also, you understand. So those means they give it for objects. For objects. So now we'll make sentence and write. What are those? You see the pictures. What are those? What they give a picture of there? What is books? So now we'll make sentence and write. First, you write those. You have to copy these words. Those are so that question that oh, those words are having right. question also. You see there. You copy this sentence. Those are books. What is the spelling of book? B O O K book and write as. Books. We have one book. Means we write a book only. We have more than one book. Means we write books. Book is a singular word. Books is a plural word. Okay. Right. Next. What are these? These means you understand. So 
So these objects are near to us. So that's why they are given B is asking. They are asking B is constant. Okay. So now write the answer. Children, what are these? What are they given in pictures? P apples. Yes, no. So now you make sentence. How to write? These T H S E these A R E R apples. What is spelling of apple? A P P L E apple and S also. Because we have it two apples now. So write plural word of apples. Okay. What are these? These are apples. Why we use these here? Because these apples are near to us. So that's why we write these are apples. Okay. You see the distance of pyramid. All right. Next page one. What are what are those? What are those? You draw the line pyramid and draw here picture of pan. Draw the picture of pen. Pens. Okay. Now we'll make right answer, children. So now the sentence and write. What are those? So first you write. Understand the question. What are those? And as you see the arrow mark, distance of these and those. When we use these, so when the objects are near to us, we use their these. When the objects are far from us, we use their those. So you see the arrow mark, distance. So the, they show showing here line around that means you understand that so those objects are far from us so that's why we use those first e h o s e those leave one finger space after that e r e r what are those in given in the pictures pens what is the spelling of pens p e n pen we have it one pen means we write only pen singular word we have it more than one pen means we write the plural word pens okay pen pen is a singular word and pens pens is a plural word okay so now i explain once again to you also listen carefully and repeat after me what i am showing you now you also like this writing in your class so you have to follow the lines and write otherwise you cannot learn children so and you have to say and write these words okay so now let us see what are these these are what are these These are balloons. Why we use these? Because these balloons are near to us. So you see the distance of arrow. So if they give a small arrow, short arrow, that means you understand. So these are these objects are near to us. So that's why we use these. Okay. And next, what are those? So why we use here those? Because because you see the arrow mark distance of objects. So those are eggs. Because those objects are Far from us, you see the distance of these and those. So these are objects near to us. So those objects far from us. You see the distance in between these and those. Okay. So these those are far from us. So that's why those are X views. And next, what are these? So here trees are near to us. So that's why we use these are trees. And next, what are those? So those jugs. So those jugs are far from us. So that's why we use those are jugs. We have it one jug means we use a jug only. We have it more than one means we use plural word jugs. And right next, what are these? So these balls are near to us. So that's why we use these are balls. And next, what are those? What are those? So they are given in the pictures. Books. Okay, we have here two books. So those books are far from us. So that's why we use. Those, those are books. When the objects are far from us, means we use those. When the objects are near to us, means we use these. And next, what are these? So they give you apples, two apples. So why we write these are apples? Because these apples are near to us. Okay. And right next, what are those? Those are pens. Why we use those? Because you see the arrow mark distance, these and those. So this is near to us. This is far from us. So that's why we use those are pens. We have more than one pens means we use their pens plural word. So those are pens. Pens are far from us. Okay, understand, children? So I hope you all are understand this. You also write me okay in your class work. Well. Okay, children? So you are completed English. So next.
Next, we learn about Kallavarya Mare. Okay, children, in the previous class, what you have learned in the Kallavarya Mare? Kannada Varna Mare. Now, we learn about Kannada Varna Mare. In the previous class, you learn two letters. Ya and Ra. Yes, na children? Am I right? Fine. Now, let us continue next letter. Ya, la, after what it comes? La. La, la, do. How to write la? A, la, 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 How to write la, children? Now, let us see. It is very easy to write you. Today, also, we learn two letters. We will learn two letters. La and wa. So, how to write la? You just write like this up and down patterns. Like, okay, and in the left curve, you can use there one put a small circle like this. This is letter of la. You have to follow the lines and write, right in between two lines. Okay, first you write like this up and down curve like this, look like a letter of u. Okay, and right here in the left curve, you use there one put small circle like this. That is letter of la, 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 do, or la, 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 clo, or la, 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 la. Claw. You know claw, children? La 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 la. Okay, you also say when you write this letter, you have to say that word or write la la do, a la 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 la, claw like. And come to next one. So in this letter, you have to write the page full. Come to next one, write there. Wa. How to write wa? Wa, wa na, forest. Wa, wa na, forest. How to write wa, children? So when you write the letter, cha, 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 so this letter also will look like both are same. So here, so in cha, we write one small standing line that is cha. So in ma, not like that, uh, don't write like that right, uh, standing line. So you just write like this. This is letter of wa. Wa, wana, forest. Wa, wana, forest. Write like this. And as such, this is letter of la, 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 And this is letter of wa, wana, forest. So these two letters also homework for you in writing Kannada class work. So two pages homework in Kannada. Okay? The understand you know? Yes, I hope you all have understood. And previous English homework also you have to write in your English class work. Don't keep any children, you have to complete the homeworks. Okay? Understand? Okay, thank you children. We will be